Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Skyrim with uh, Julian here. In the last episode, we cleared out this fort, and Julian took the uh, I've got your back. Took the captain's quarters as a bit of a reprieve from the cold outside. Oops. And uh, yeah, so we are going to put out this fire that we've been using to get warm and destroy the uh, the campfire. We spent the night here uh, and got warm and we are, uh, I don't know why you're sitting down Lydia because we're about to leave. So uh, let's go. All right. I've got your back. Okay, let's uh, to teach you a lesson. Huh? Let's try hey, this again. Come here. So, first things first, we are going to uh, pull this cat out of the bag. Come on. Come on. You're just gonna. Okay, well. You're just gonna stand there. I will. Okay, you. You just completely destroyed my frost astronaut while he was busy doing nothing, possibly attacking Lydia. Um, all right, go useless familiar. <laughs> definitely. But he. Uh, okay, nope. He's not. He's not even cannon fodder. I was gonna say at least he kind of deters them, but uh, no, it's. Okay. Ah, uh, yes. Get him while he is down. Get him. Yes. Okay. Um. Drink a potion and drink another few potions because. Well, I was, and then I drank. Uh, you know, potions in the few milliseconds it took you to swing your sword. Why? 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 Okay, we're going to... Okay. Let's, uh, okay, no, we're, we're going in the totally wrong direction. But you know what? Doesn't matter. We're gonna pop out the other side. See how they, uh, see how they like that. No, Lydia, the, the intent was for you to, uh, continue to fight them, Lydia. You can't hide from me. <laughs> Apparently, no, I cannot. There should be a, another one around here, so I need to uh, kind of keep an eye out for that as well. Okay. All right. Okay. Let's, uh... Do this again, okay? There he, because that was that was honestly a little humorous. Come on, come on. Okay, fine, fine. Do that. Please don't murder me while I'm uh, doing my best to heal. And I have no magic, so. That's nice. Come on, come on. Swing at me, bro. Do your worst. Or just let Lydia come in behind you. Okay, so I have zero Magicka regeneration for some reason. Um. Whoops. You know, yes, uh, let's do that. And let's also give us a little bit of... 
Alright, I'd... I'd say that was, uh, pretty effective. Pretty, uh... Pretty darn effective. Mace of draining. Where did the other one go? You know what? I'm I'm not even not even worried about it. I just want to uh Whoops. Okay, we're warm. Let's let's take advantage of our warmth and hoof it to uh Winterhold. Well, that was that was lovely, wasn't it, Lydia? And what? Whoops, wrong one. Head injury. Injured for roughly two minutes, or until fully healed, stops magic regeneration and drains five points per second. Oh, okay, okay. And spine injury. Power attacks and deal. Double damage and stagger. Oh, so when we when we get those damage, okay. So that's that's not good. Um, do we have no. We don't have any magicka, but we can drink some magic potions and heal up. And those should yes, wonderful. They disappear. And now we have a um. What on? Are you okay? Um. Okay. Good. Good day to you. Wolf. Um. All right then. That may come to uh, make may come back to bite me, quite literally. But uh, it it wasn't hurting us. We aren't going to hurt it. But we are going to do our best to hurry up. I'm also going to drink a quick uh, frost resistance potion. And it looks like these people are... Uh, are hostile wolves versus uh, friendly neighborhood wolf over there. The astute modders or uh, mod users per se among you I've been looking for you got something uh, I'm supposed to deliver your hands only let's see here ah a letter from the Jarl moving up in the world eh apparently looks like that's it got to go okay well um thank you the astute mod users of you uh, will notice that there's something slightly different with, with, that fire. with uh well no I'll just I'll just leave the wolf to eat you how about that random jumping wolves uh, yeah you may just notice something slightly different with uh, the College of Winterhold and uh, unless you already know about it I'm not going to spoil it no, 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 no. We're, we're not, thank you. Thank you very much. I'm not here to join your drunken party. All right, let's, uh, Lydia, Lydia, yeah, behind me, Lydia. Whatever would you do without me? Oh, I, see, I came back over here because I thought that was one of the wolves. It, it was not. It, uh, was not. Ah, oh, the Shrine of Azura. Amazing. I swear, this game is just beautiful. <laughs> Freezing just in time to, uh, head to the inn. And warm up for a bit. Yeah, you may you may notice some some differences in the uh, the exterior, and there will definitely be differences on the interior as well. 
and I think it adds a whole lot. I've actually never used this mod, but it comes very highly recommended. And uh, it's not always been there. Huh. I, I, that... All right, then. The frozen hearth. Let's hope it's not that frozen, because sorry, we are currently freezing to death. Like some horrible monster was turned inside out. And Don't mind me, exploded. just uh, using the fire. The mages don't let us go in the column. It was a minor they said it's not safe in there. I've already corrected it for future experiments. Well, um, I would agree this, for a child of your stature. This is why people have a problem Aster with the says college. his paw says the college makes in. lots of bad things Let's happen. The fire. But the mages have seen the cold look nice. Well, um, I suppose that bodes well for me, doesn't it, There's child? There's not many people left in Winterhold, so I only have Aster to play with. And sometimes he's mean. Well, you're you're very very talkative, aren't you? Aster always wants to play hunt an elf, and he makes me be the elf. Do you, do you always talk this much to strangers? Hi there. Apparently, all right then. Well, um, Hi there. not nice child. Uh. We are comfortable, so that's good. We're gonna stop in. If there's, if you have business with the college, you're welcome to stay here. It's where most of our business comes from, in fact. Um, I'd like a refill of water, if possible. Of course. Thank you. And uh, 35 gold, that's actually, well, I suppose it is several um, uh, bladders of water. Um, I overheard something about the college. What were you all talking about? Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Or we can rent a room. Sure. Uh, I hate, I hate the, um, I just, I hate the interface for communication. That's right. College of Interval, just north of town. Hard to miss. Yeah, a little bit. Um, seems like you weren't very talkative about it, but that's all right. I'll show you to your room, right this way. Um, d no need, sir. I'm not actually going to be, um, using it. But thank you. The mages don't let us go in the college. They said it's not safe in there. Apparently it's not safe in here. All right. So, uh, yeah. Let's head off to the, uh, the college. Still here. Actually, I think before we head off to the college, we're going to stop in uh, to the shop here and sell off some of our items. Hello. I'll sell just about anything if it's worth my time. Keep that in mind, will you? Well, what do you have for sale? Take a look. All right, guys, I'm going to go through, sell some of our stuff, and I will be right back. All right, so we sold everything we needed to. Good day. Yes, thank you. And uh, one of the things that we got, I, I am extremely excited about, and it is a piece of clothing that we are going to uh, favorite. And it's called the Necklace of the Wraith King. An immortal ghost fights for you. It has 60 points of health and stamina. Literally... This is what it is. Still here. A ghost that fights for us. And I think that that... I think that applies to Julian just perfectly. He has a magical ghost companion. We can't uh, we can't talk to him. We can't do anything. We, we can't pass through him, which I think would be absolutely lovely. But, uh, you know, can't have everything. But... It, I've got your back. It's just, just look at it. Just look at it. It's it's wonderful, and uh, we are actually going to favorite this to seven. So now, we take it off. I think he's unsummoned. Is he unsummoned? Yes, he's unsummoned. Seven, and boom! There there he is. I think that is just probably the coolest thing 
imaginable. Um, and if you don't think so, well, then you can stop watching. No, I, I'm kidding. But it, I, I find that just absolutely spectacular. Don't suppose you'd enchant my sword. Anyway, let's uh, let's head into the college. This doesn't seem uh, very welcoming, but uh, nonetheless. Cross the bridge at your own peril. The way is dangerous, and the gate will not open. You shall not gain entry. And why exactly are you out here? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. And if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. The more important question is, why are you here? I, I would like to enter the college. Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? Hmm. I want to use the power of ice and fire to destroy any who oppose me. I see. That power certainly exists, I assure you. Wield it faithfully, and few can withstand you. It would seem that the college has what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. A small test, if you will. I'll take your test. Excellent. A standard spell for one skilled in destruction magic is the Firebolt. Casting one at the seal on the ground here would be sufficient. Um, I, I don't exactly know that spell. No? Well, if you think you're capable of it, then I'd be happy to provide it to you for a mere 30 gold. Or you can try your luck with one of the court wizards around Skyrim. They also sell spells. I'll just buy it from you, I suppose. Here you are. Now I'm anxious to see you cast it. Alright, so Firebolt. We finally have something to uh, upgrade our arsenal and I think we are going to we're going to switch that out so we're finally going to be moving up Winterhold's glory days may lie behind it but the college lives on so just cast it here on the no seal what, the well done indeed I think you'll be a superb addition to the college welcome apprentice I'll lead you across the bridge once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabel Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. Alright. So, uh, I think that's where we're going to end the episode, guys. While she awkwardly launches Mage Light. Anyway, I really enjoyed this video, guys. I enjoyed making it. I hope you enjoyed watching it. If you did enjoy, make sure to click that like button. Bucken. Yes, the, the quality that y'all expect from me. Anyway, if you did enjoy, make sure to click that like button. If you really enjoyed, make sure to subscribe. And I will be back soon with the next one, guys. Cheers.